Welcome to Byte Further. In today's video, you'll learn what to do when your iPhone 12 says support.apple.com slash iPhone slash restore. If you are a veteran iPhone user, you are probably aware of iPhone recovery mode. It's also called the restore screen, where you'll see support.apple.com slash iPhone slash restore message, along with a computer and a cable showing on a black screen. While it's a useful tool for updating or restoring your iPhone 12 to remedy the software issues, using recovery mode is not always as smooth as expected. At times, your iPhone 12 may enter recovery mode and show support.apple.com slash iPhone slash restore without your knowledge and leave you frustrated. The stuck recovery mode often occurs when you fail to update or restore your phone, restore your phone from an old backup, or set up the device from scratch. Besides, the support.apple.com slash iPhone slash restore slash error will also appear if your iPhone 12 has hardware damage. In most cases, getting out of your iPhone 12 recovery mode screen is a straightforward process. However, hell freezes and the sky falls once you find iPhone 12 stuck on support.apple.com slash iPhone slash restore slash or unsure about how to remove the restore screen. Thankfully, we're here to help you out. There are mainly two ways to fix an iPhone 12 that says support.apple.com slash iPhone slash restore. One is to force restart your device. The other one is to use a Windows or Mac computer to exit the recovery mode. Now, let's take a look. The first way to fix iPhone 12 stuck on support.apple.com slash iPhone slash restore screen is to do a forced restart. How it works is that you use a specific key combination to turn your iPhone 12 off and then turn it back on. After booting up, your iPhone 12 screen won't say support.apple.com slash iPhone slash restore anymore. This will take a minute or two and might work without affecting your device's essential data. We'll introduce the steps below, which can be used in an iPhone 12 mini, iPhone 12, iPhone 12 Pro and iPhone 12 Pro Max. Now, let's start with that. Quickly press then release volume up button, volume down button, and then press the side button and hold it for a while. The device should turn off, getting past the support.apple.com slash iPhone slash restore screen. Still keep holding the side button. After around 10 to 15 seconds, the Apple logo will come up. Now, release the button. Just wait a few seconds and thereafter, your device should boot up and show the lock screen. You can try this a few more times if it doesn't work at once. The second way to get out of the recovery mode screen is to use a Windows or Mac computer to do an update or restore. Plenty of iPhone 12 users say they have encountered stuck support.apple.com slash iPhone slash restore issues after doing a failed update or restore on the phone. Few users have acknowledged that there's also another safe way to do the update or restore. That is to put the device into recovery mode and use iTunes or Finder to do that. Now, let's start with that. On your Windows or Mac computer, open iTunes or Finder. If you've not got one, head to the Apple website to download it first. Get your iPhone 12 and connect it to the computer with a USB cord. Once connected, you should see there's a dialog box showing up giving update and restore options. If not, click your device icon from the right panel of the iTunes or Finder software window. Now, we suggest clicking the update option to do a system upgrade first. It won't delete any data and settings on your iPhone 12 to bypass the support.apple.com slash iPhone slash restore screen. Click the update option and then continue to follow the on-screen instructions until it starts downloading and installing the latest version of iOS software into your iPhone 12 to fix the stuck restore screen. After the update, wait for your iPhone 12 to restart again and boot up to the home screen. Hope the issue that iPhone 12 says support Apple.com iPhone Restore is fixed. Suppose the update doesn't work, you'll then repeat the steps before and choose the restore option to perform a factory reset. Note that this will erase everything from your phone, including apps, accounts, contacts, photos, data, and other data. So, make sure you back up all your data first. If the issue persists after trying all these troubleshooting steps including factory reset, it's advisable to contact Apple support for further assistance. That's all how to fix iPhone 12 that says support.apple.com slash iPhone slash restore. Hope this video can help fix the stuck recovery mode and get out of the restore screen quickly. If it does, please give it a thumbs up and share it via Facebook, Twitter, and so on to help others in need. Also, if you have any further questions, 
Feel free to write them down in the comments below and I'll reply ASAP. To learn more tech tips about iPhones, subscribe to the Byte Further channel. Now, you can click another video on the screen to keep watching.